Mr. Shehoyu, as you are highly given a for with Feed the Veld. This is a woman, a, a Holocaust survivor. Her parents perished in the Holocaust. They both died in Auschwitz. I received a phone call from a lady that has a friend, a Jewish woman, who, who uh, told her that there's a Jewish friend of hers in the morgue at the Jewish General Hospital already for a long time. And I, I went to the Jewish, I inquired. She was two weeks in the morgue at the Jewish. She passed away May 25th. Where are we now? We're June, we're July. July, July. So, July 15. I went, I searched everywhere. I found a place where they do cremation. The lady I called up, she told me that she's about to be cremated this week. She told me that she's an unclaimed body and there's nobody, nobody that took responsibility. The government gives an allowance of a certain amount of time. She has to be cremated. A privilege to know Jewish people who stretched themselves backwards for a woman that didn't have an opportunity in life. She was a Finnick Shanishburg. She was 10 years old in the war. And here she is in a Jewish cemetery. We have a Jewish funeral. We have a minion. People that, that stretch themselves backwards to make such a difference. Everything is taken care of. Kiddush Hashem, Sidua Bashafir. If Hashem wanted someone to be buried, her, her father, grandfather probably looked after her. A kid that didn't want to know anything with Judaism because she was afraid to identify as Jewish. I called her, her friend, a French lady. She told me, she hung up the phone, she wants nothing to do with it. So, Baruch Hashem, we were privileged to do this. Akid Hashem, Mikam Chayisru, Baruch Hashem.